forgive you. I missed you a lot. <laughs> I missed you too, so much. And everything's so crazy now. With what? Like your uncle or Cole's mom? Both, but... But what? Is everything okay with you, Mark? I don't know what to do. About what? Marco got into UCLA and he's refusing to go because of me. He says he doesn't want us to be apart. First off, why would he apply to a school that's halfway across the country? He got into film school. Start. Marco wants to make movies. And UCLA is one of the best film schools in the country. That's great, but he's still totally into you. Into me enough to pass up the chance of a lifetime? Look, I, I didn't mean to be such a downer. I just, just can't seem to avoid it these days. Are you sure there's no chance for you to star? Can't you work things out? Please don't be mad at me, okay? I didn't tell you because it wasn't that important. If Ozzy didn't stop by just now, you never would have known His about name it. is Oliver. The guy brought you flowers and you treated him like something stuck on your shoe. I didn't want him to get the wrong idea. You had sex with him. What idea was he supposed to get? Oh, come on. Haven't you ever hooked up with a guy for one night? No. Are you kidding me? What is wrong with you, Stacy? Did you really need to have sex so much that you dragged home the first stranger you could find? Listen, Balsam, there was a mix-up with those DNA test results. The computer made a mistake. You are not David Vickers' son. Are you sure? I'm positive. You're not related to him in any way at all. And I'm sorry that I put you through this whole mess. You know, I should have... I should have quadruple checked the test results before I pass that news to you. Man, you, you must have had a, a nightmare last night. You have no idea. Yeah, well, it's all over now. Even, even if you don't know who your father is, at least you know that it's not David Vickers. Thanks, Bo. What? Speak up, young man. Let us hear loud and clear that David is Bo and Clint's brother. We fixed the computer, and I ran David's DNA through the system this time, and I came up with a definitive match for him. And is he a Buchanan? Yes. David Vickers is a Buchanan. <laughs> Marco can be a film major at LU. <sighs> nice try, Star. But it's not like he's gonna hold it against you. Not right away, maybe. But how long is he gonna like taking classes that don't measure up to UCLA? And hanging out with his high school girlfriend? At least he wants to be with you. <sighs> I know. Supposed to be the four of us. I know. Our guys going to college. You and me finishing high school so we can be with them. Fantastic four. I used to be able to see my whole future in my head. And without starting the picture, I can't even see the next five minutes. Doesn't it seem like a hundred years ago when we had all those dreams? No, not to me, it doesn't. I guess having a baby and losing her. Cole and I really had to grow up fast because of that. He became a different person. Probably feels the same way about me. Isn't there any way that you two can get back together? It isn't even about all the things the star's dad did or her letting him off the hook. She's still on your case, you know, about the pills and stuff. Uh, we had problems way before that. Because of the baby? Star and I, we used to see everything the same way. Now, I can't even talk to her. I was with Cole when we found out about the scene our parents made at the ball. And for a minute, we were close again. And I remembered what it was like between us. And then it, and then it was just gone. 
Is he still taking those pills? I don't know. Maybe. Cole's life sucks right now. I made him promise that he would go to LU because if he, if he went away to college with complete strangers, I don't know what would happen to him. Do you talk to Mr. J about Cole when you're working on that project? Sort of, but he doesn't know that it's Cole I'm talking about. And he gives you advice and stuff? He more just listens. That's what I really liked about Cole when we first met. He's a really good listener. Hey, man. Nothing's over till it's over. I'm still holding out for the original plan. Four of us together. Mark of the Dreamer. At least you and I are back together. <laughs> yeah, that's a start. Okay, so maybe I shouldn't have brought Oliver home. My son could have walked in on you too. Look, I had never been to an honest to goodness gala before, okay? I got carried away. I didn't want the night to end. You haven't heard of going out for a drink and okay. talking. Yeah, now you're sounding like mom. You took him to bed and then you blew him off. You didn't even give yourself a chance to get to know the guy. I don't want a relationship. It gets in the way. Of what? Of being with you. Look, I want to get to know my big sister. I want to get to know my nephew and Rex. You and David have a thing. You hook up. Oh, yeah. How, how'd that work? He had a lot of chemistry. He was very attracted to me, as you can imagine, but I had to let him go. All right. I I'll tell you, I keep looking for the resemblance. I just don't see it. Oh, well, there is. Because you got at least one thing in common. You're both very well groomed. OK, cut the crap, Rox. That phone call I just got, that was Bo. The lab made a mistake. Turns out David Vickers ain't your baby daddy. Oh. Well, gee, really? Really? So why'd you say it was? Uh, Clint, do you think you could give me the name of your monogrammer? I'm going to need to get all of these changed. Ah, oh, yes, of course. And we'll also get a decorator so that all traces of your dear departed father's hideous taste are wiped out. Bo, Clint, Nora. Get out. Looks like you're gonna have to call off those lawyers, Clint. Turns out I'm entitled to every red cent Pa left me. Yeah. Wait a minute. Sorry, young man. No, there's... You're finished. Bye 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 What is it, Lewis? Asa Buchanan is not David Vickers' father. Ah! Yes! <laughs> Bo Buchanan is. Yes. <laughs>